Animated Mail. Welcome back to the Animated Universe of Mail. I am Mel. Let's get into some Fire Force episode number three. Let's see where Shinra's going to take us this time. You know, he's obviously trying to discover more about his mother. And yeah, let's get into it. Make sure y'all subscribe if you haven't already. And please hit them thumbs. It's going straight up to the sky. All right, let's get into it. You said you would let me see my mother, right? Is she going to dip out? She grimy as hell. How may I show Shinra? It looks... One more pillar is about to be born. I wonder what that means. One more pillar is about to be born. Are oh, those the ones who got taken over? Oh, they've been controlled. Yep. They stay hunting. I like the way their outfits look, but they stay hunting in the distance. It's like snipers. Amil! She kicked his ass. A new flashpoint. Episode 3. <laughs> that old dude is addicted to them with dollar bursts. Duh! He dodged that. He was like, yep, there's no way he's that. Gomoro <laughs> hero dakara. Fire Defense Agency Chief. So I don't consider myself mature. Then do you consider yourself growing up? I feel like some. I feel like this defense guy. Something's he shady. This is probably. Panda Sancho. Uh oh. So is this pink haired chick probably the new one? She's probably the the new pillar. Possibly. Oh damn, so she can see the direction of of how this is going? So maybe they're working with the evangelist. Or unless they're like unless they're like some kind of bounty hunters for uh, the the these human combustions. Bruh, if you if there's a fire that happens in your house and someone immediately appears I will be completely suspicious, like, uh, you have to give me your valuables first if you want me to help you? Bruh, they robbing an old dude. They doing all this for bread. I mean, you can't hate the hustle on me, but it's still grimy. She's a first generation, huh? No, 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 she's not. So she might be an unprecedented fourth generation. Now, I think she's the sleeper. She's the fourth pillar. Damn, she was excited. Sense of elation around all that fire and destruction, yo. What is really going on in her mind? But she could be very useful. Yo, she would be a dope firefighter. She saves their lives for valuables. Ooh, an adrenaline junkie. I mean, she she kind of does seem like an adrenaline junkie, especially if she likes to be in danger and thrilling situations. Oh, what the hell? Danger like be born. She's seen some... Bruh. Oh, she just... She saw that dangerous crazy woman. Dude, her eyes glowed as soon as she... Danger? Oh, the fifth pillar, not the fourth one. The fifth pillar. Oh, they're probably about to meet up. Holy crap! The entire town is about to go up. She said, people are going to die. Time to make some money. How is she happy about this? Like, you have to be a twisted person. Bruh, this mysterious girl. She's like a fire orchestra. Conductor's baton. She grimy. Okay, Shinra got his game face on. He ready. Set permission for Shinra. In the white clad. Here we go, Arthur and Shinra. Put that mask on, Company A. We out. Bro, that's wild. She all about the money, man. She's a thrill seeker. And this person sitting on the freaking top of the house reading people's minds. Found you. She look thick. Look, well, she look thick. Yo, she's spazzing out on him. Like, calm down, get off me. Oh! He showed up! Inka! Bruh, you grabbed the wrong dude. Duh! His body! Gone! She nervous now? Or is she excited? 
the quest for even. I guarantee she's gonna like this. I guarantee she's gonna like this. You need me? Oh! Yo, her powers are pretty sick. That's pretty sick. Oh, she can see it all. She can see it all. She's dope. That's a dope ass ability. She probably feel uh, Shinra. The hero has arrived, baby. We in here. If I catch you both, it'll be two pills with one stone. Oh, these dudes are. Oh, these. Oh! Oh! Oh, so, 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 I'm, I'm getting hyped up! Ah! Oh! Did they power him up? He's fast, but he's weak. At least he's not strong enough to hurt him. Man, kick ass. You're a nimble little fire cat. Bro, he takes a step and explosions. He's just walking and there's explosions. He's, oh, bruh. I feel like the, the Inca chick is going to go with the, the evangelist. Run away with the fast feet you're so proud of. Bakurangoya! Good episode. Holy crap, that was a good episode. Man, Inca, she shows up. She's going to be the fifth pillar now. And so <laughs> the evangelist is trying to get her. But the fire force is there, you know, Shimba's showing up. But oh my gosh, her powers are sick. The, the ability to sense out when a fire is coming or just any traces of kind of flames or heat. Dodge ability. So if you're even going against someone who attacks with fire, or obviously it's everyone, um, you already know where they're going to go. You know, maybe you uh, you can sense them, but like you can't sense them approaching because she didn't even sense old boy when he first appeared and he just killed her friend. But when he was attacking it, oh man. And her ability, start, go, that's hard. Like, imagine if she mastered that ability. Like, how stronger that would... Oh, my gosh. You know, the, 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 the possibilities are endless. But needless to say, I'm excited uh, to see where this is going to go. I, I'm honestly thinking she's going to go with the Evangelist. That's what I'm thinking. I hope she doesn't, you know, because it'll be more firepower for the good guys. But I'm thinking she's going to go with the Evangelist. But... Who knows? We'll see. Make sure you all subscribe and let me know your thoughts about this episode. Other than that, you all have a beautiful day. And do not forget, if there's no one else in this world that believes in you, I do. Bye-bye! I don't think they know about me. I'm a beast. I'm a chief from the 513. I never bite my tongue. I wasn't raised like that. Anything I want to say, I'm going to say it next step. Because I never hold back. If there's a problem, I'm going to say it to your face. Never talk behind your back. I'm going to give it to you straight.